Picture producer came to the studio. Come to the studio tomorrow morning, and I'll give you a lifetime contract. <sighs> Passionella went home bursting with joy. The next morning, without bothering to look in the mirror, she rushed off to the movie studio. Lifetime contract? Are you out of your head? There she was, her homely old self. <laughs> then it was all just a dream. Ella walked the streets till the sun set. I'm not asking much, she brooded. It's not as if I want to be a rich, beautiful, glamorous movie star. Yeah. Or even a well-liked, beautiful, glamorous movie star. I just want to be a beautiful, glamorous movie star for its own sake. <laughs> as the moon lit the sky, she returned home. This is your friendly neighborhood godmother! Where you been? Look at me! Cried Ella. I'm just the way I've always been. Oh, are you indeed? Snickered the TV set and <laughs> Your friendly neighborhood godmother only has power from the Mickey Mouse Club through the Late Late Show. During those hours, you shall be Sustaining. And with that, her friendly neighborhood godmother signed off. In the months that followed, a new star was born, the mysterious, exotic, bewitching seventress, Passionella. A legend grew around. 
strange stories circulated. <laughs> stories of how she would only allow her films to be shot between the hours of the Mickey Mouse Club and the Late Late Show. <laughs> and how at 3 a.m. she would hop into her sports car and vanish. Who is that mysterious passionella? Fans and colors of wonder. What is her secret? Ask show business. And as her mystery grew, so did her popularity. Her pictures and attendance records. Songs were written about her. became a ceaseless round of cocktail parties, nightclub parties, publicity parties, beat parties. But was Passionella happy? Now that she had money, fame, glamour, excitement, was she truly content? Let us hear the answer in her own words. I am not truly content. <laughs> she began to feel a vague discomfort, a certain indefinable happiness. Don't feel unhappy, said her producers, and they bought her a new house. Don't feel unhappy, said her director, and they bought her a swimming pool for her new house. Don't, Don't feel, feel unhappy, said her legion of faithful fans, and they bought her a beach to go with the swimming pool of her new house. But Pachinella was still not happy. What does it all mean if I cannot have love? She spent her nights acting and her days Weep it. <laughs> oh, how hard it was all to me without the right man to share it with. <laughs> Finally, she spoke to her friendly neighborhood dog. My field is strictly public relations. You'll have to handle your own emotional problems. <laughs> <laughs> and then, one day, Pashanella met the right man. <laughs> Yeah.